Hello, welcome back to a bite-sized Pilates. So today is a shoulder focus, so working on our shoulder stability whilst maintaining control of our trunk. Um, should be about 15 minutes long. Remember there's different levels of exercise, so do whichever level you can control that you can maintain good posture and breathing with. Okay, so we're going to start with warming warm up to start off with. So we're going to go into our hundreds. So palms facing behind you, just go down into a mini squat, so gauge through your core, nice long spine, and just pulse the palms to the back of the room. Really opening up wide through that collarbone. Nice long neck, like someone's pulling you up from the crown of your head, looking forward. Breathing in and out through your nose. Engaging through the core, so drawing the belly button towards the spine. But really try and get the range, really pulse the palms of the hands to the back of the room. Opening up that collarbone, starting to warm up the back of our shoulders. Nice. Keep the pulse on. Okay, we're going to come and stand up, elbows in, and we're going to come up onto our toes and reach our palms out. So palms facing the ceiling, just rotating round through the shoulder, elbows staying into the side. This time into Cleopatra, so lengthen the arms away and tuck them in as they come back. So rotate round, lengthen away, tucking back in. Again, maintaining really good posture with this nice tall spine, nice open collarbone, really opening up wide through that chest. This time stay at the top, just do backwards little circles with the arms. Nice, keep that posture, keep the length in the spine, keep the height of the shoulders. Coming back in, coming up and this time forward circles with the arms. Really nice length of the arms. Good, back in, open again, backward circles. Good, coming back in, last one of this, forward circles. Good, coming down on the heels but keeping the arms wide. You're going to bend at the elbow. So we've got both arms out to 90, bent at the elbow. And we're just going to rotate through. So keep your trunk really nice and still. Tall through your spine, so this one's pulling you up from the crown of that head. Nice open collarbone, keeping that trunk really still and just rotating through those shoulders. Good, hold there, we're going to pulse. Good, rotate the other way and pulse. Good, back to just rotating. Nice. Good, let's go for five more. Keep the height, so don't let your elbows drop down below. Keep it level with your shoulder, just rotating through. Good, two, one. Nice, and relax, good. Hopefully our shoulders are nice and warmed up now. First exercise we're gonna go on to on the floor is shoulder taps. So level one, place your hands underneath your shoulders, your knees underneath your hips, and just lift that chest bone away from your hands to really engage through those shoulders and engage through your core, draw your belly button towards your spine. I'm just gonna pulse the arm out to the side, keeping our trunk really still. Level two, tuck your toes under, lift your knees up, and again, pulsing that arm. Level three, we're gonna go into a straight arm plank, make sure your arms are underneath your shoulders again. And we're just gonna pulse that arm. So pick your level, level one knees down, level two knees up, level three with me, Let's inhale to prepare, exhale into position, and let's pulse. So whilst we're doing this, keep that nice long neck. So looking straight down at the ground, keeping that chest bone away from the mat, keeping your trunk really nice and square, so no rotation. And mainly keep that hand nice and hard. Don't let it go down. Work the back of that shoulder, nice. Keep the breathing in and out through your nose. Keeping that chest high, keeping that trunk stable as we pulse this arm. Keeping that long neck looking straight down. Let's go for 10 more. Really good. And relax, nice. We're gonna go straight onto the other side. So again, level one knees down. Level two knees up, level three with me. Inhale to prepare, exhale into position. 
and let's go. So again, really reaching for height, but without rotating that trunk. Keep that chest bone nice and high. Nice long neck, really well done. Engaging through that core and getting the height of that hand. Really work that shoulder. So both shoulders are working here. The one on the ground and the one in the air. And our trunk is working really hard to stabilize us too. Good. Good, keep the rate up, keep the height. Let's go for 10 more. Really good. And relax down. Good work, nice. We're gonna go onto our front now. I'm gonna do a breast stroke and work the back of our shoulders and arms. So, placing your forehead down on the mat so you've got a nice long neck. Palms facing your body, so in towards each other. Level one, you're just gonna open that collarbone and pulse your little fingers towards the ceiling. Level two, lift your chest bone up, keep that neck nice and long and pulse those little fingers nice and high. Level three, squeeze your bum with it, lift the legs and pulse the arms. So I'm gonna do level three with you guys. So pick your level, inhale, into position, exhale, let's go. So to protect your lower back, make sure you're drawing your belly button towards your spine. Really open up through the collarbones. Get those little fingers as high as you can. Really work the back of those shoulders, the triceps. Breathing in and out through your nose, expanding through your chest. Good. Keep the height, keep squeezing your palms together and high. Keep that neck nice and long. So if you're doing level three, squeeze your bottom, lengthen those legs away. Really nice. Let's go for a last 10, come on, reach for the height. This last view. Good, five. And relax down, good. The next one we're gonna do is the swimming. So in the same position, Level one, forehead on the ground, but this time hands above your head. And you're just gonna alternate, lifting one hand above your head at a time, keeping everything else still. Level two, lift that chest bone up, and alternate lifting those arms up. Level three, engage the glutes. So it's opposite arm, opposite leg. Okay, so when you're ready, I'm gonna do level three, pick your level, inhale into position, Exhale, let's go. So with this one, try and keep your trunk really nice and still. Just moving the shoulders, if you're doing level three, legs as well, but the trunk stays dead still. Try and get the height. Really reach those elbows nice and high. Working the backs of those shoulders. Good, on the next one, we're gonna pause and pulse that side. Good, switch and pulse that side. Back to alternating. Good, push the height of the shoulders, really get the height. Nice, well done. Good, keep pushing the range. And hold and pulse. And switch and pulse. Good, last few alternating, get the height. Good, three, two, and relax. Good, good work. Okay, the last one we're gonna do is a rotational side plank. So really controlling that shoulder as we work our trunk. So three levels here. One, you can go up onto your knees and your elbow, and just rotating through, reaching up, rotating around that shoulder. Level three, sorry, level two, you come up onto your feet and elbow and just rotate through. And level three, you come up onto your hand, rotate through and control that motion. I'm gonna do level two with you guys, so my elbow and feet, but pick whichever level you can control. So when you're ready, inhale into position, 
open that chest, nice long spine, let's rotate. Good, and really go all the way under, tuck as far under as you can, really rotating through that shoulder, then reaching up nice and high. Try to control your breathing, so in and out through your nose, staying strong through your core, so drawing that belly button towards your spine. Nice, well done. Let's go for five more, really reach this last five. Good, four more, reach, reach, reach. Nice and high, last three. Good. Reach for this last one. Nice and relax down. Really good, we're going to go straight onto the other side. It's our last exercise, we're really working that shoulder and controlling through our trunk. So level one, knees and elbow. Level two with me, feet and elbow. Level three, hands and feet. Okay, inhale into position. Open that chest, length of neck. Exhale, let's go. Nice. Really rotating through that shoulder, reach behind you, then reach nice and high to the sky. Remember you're breathing with it, nice controlled breathing. Really well done. Good. Really working those shoulder muscles as we rotate through. And also really engaging these side trunk muscles to help control us as well. Nice. Good. Keep that breathing, keep that long neck open through the collarbone. Let's go for five more. Good, reach for this ball. Keep the breathing on. Last two. Good, last one. Nice and relax down. Really good work. Hope you felt your trunk and your shoulders working a little bit there. See you again soon. Bye bye.